today we are joined in studio. I'm the only guy here. There's uh, <laughs> five bright faces. But first of all, let's welcome Claire back from uh, HSM. Thank you very much. Thank you for having me. And it's all about those bursaries that you donated uh, at our Teddython last year uh, with over 160,000 rand. So let's pick up where we left off last time. We uh, said that you were making those bursaries available. A huge heartfelt thanks to everybody who did enter. We had amazing entries and it has been quite the task to go through all of them um, mm. for, for the bursary competition. Okay, well, we're not there yet, Tara. Uh, still, uh, still a little no, way to go. We're not. So we've been keeping tabs with everybody at Hot Cares, and they've been wading through mountains of worthy recipients and the motivations that they've been sending in as well. And we've had a few requests from listeners to give them an idea of the kind of caliber of person that we'd like to give these bursaries to. So we thought we'd bring in three finalists today mm -hmm. to try and explain what they've submitted, why they would like to apply for these bursaries, and just tell us a little bit about their life journeys and how they came to this point. All right, so let's start off first of all with uh, Kelly. Um, it's a career I really want to follow. I've been in a lot of jobs doing dealing with customers. I've been a board manager, supervisor of a bean tree cafe, and I loved working with people overall. There we go. That it's is really something that I want to do. That is Got really a passion for this. Let's go to uh, Kaylee. In the, by nature, I'm already a very nurturing person and just the ability to take people through an experience just by looking after them and, you know, just making their time anywhere worthwhile. It brings me so much joy. And I've had such a passion for the hospitality industry for a while now. And, you know, just the way I've been raised by my gran, just the values she's instilled in me has made me this person that wants to take care of people. Okay. And uh, then we have Amy, last but not least. Amy, tell us your story. So, honestly speaking, when it came to the hospitality industry, I think I'm relatively new to it compared to the other two that is here with me. But I must say, once I found out about what it entitles, I think it's something that I can do. Because even though growing up I was a very quiet and shy child, but I realized I'm actually a people's person. I'm a very good listener. And even my love, it my, yeah, my, love. my name means love. So it's just, I think it comes naturally to me to care for people, especially having three younger siblings and having to help, like, look after them. So, I honestly just, I don't know what to say. <laughs> well, uh, one more from one question from me uh, when it comes to all three of you. Obviously, this is your passion. This is what you want to do. I would imagine that it's an expensive thing to be able to do for, for you. Uh, and the funding is probably one of the challenges that you guys have had, right? Definitely, definitely. Okay, well, uh, that's why you're here. And, and it's wonderful that you three could come in as finalists today to try and give everybody an idea of the kind of caliber of people that we're looking for and, and what HSM is looking for in, in growing the industry and the people who work in it. So there are three bursaries, Claire. Yes. And we have three people here. Yes. <laughs> so uh, where do we go from here? Well, ladies, we actually have you here that you're under the impression as finalists but I'd like to let you know that you are all bursary recipients. Congratulations. And we cannot wait to have you join us at HSF. Thank you so much. And Claire, just, just talk to us about how their motivations and their applications stuck out for you guys at HSM. I think if, if anything, in you know, the mass amount of entries that we got, it was very, very, very clear. The determination, the tenacity, and just the hardworking ethic that uh, came through in your, your entries, um, it, it really stood up for us. And we cannot wait to have you in our world. 